Focus Conservation. Um, Jay, you've got your tabs here, so find conservation. We're going to do fast forward here. It's in the back. Find your conservation tab. Conservation Commission is requesting, and I'm going to read the right line so I don't get... So I don't get <laughs> Mr. Bluff upset. We're looking at 35525 Is that acceptable and correct and all that good stuff? It's acceptable, correct, and all that good okay. stuff. Okay. <laughs> uh, may I have a motion, and then we'll ask Mr. Diener to explain, or you guys can question him. Moved by Mr. LeBranch, seconded by Mr. Henderson. Good evening, Mr. Diener and Rayanne. Mm -hmm. All right. Do you want to discuss, explain, uh, tell us anything about your budget for next year for conservation? Sure. Um, let me just quickly take you through some of the changes. But before I do that, um, I'm here in place of Barbara Renault, right. who is our chairman of the Conservation Commission. She's also supervisor of the checklist. She's okay, had a little bit of a busy week this week. <laughs> yeah. um, so Rayanne, our conservation coordinator, and I are here to answer all your questions. Um, I'll walk you quickly through the changes. Um, going down the roster, we are asking for a 2% salary increase for our conservation coordinator, which is the same rate that other non-union town employees are um, being requested uh, for this year. Probably the biggest change is we're asking for $1,500 for easement monitoring. Um, let me just take a moment to explain that a little bit. Um, the town has approximately 1,500 properties um, that are protected properties. And it's the job of the Conservation Commission to be monitoring those properties. With our one part-time employee and a volunteer commission, we're, we just don't have the time to do that. This year, we secured a grant um, through Rianne's good work from the Davis Foundation to do easement monitoring. And we hired a UNH grad student who came in during the summer. He walked or paddled over um, 40 properties, wrote a report on each one, photo documented uh, what he saw on each of, of the properties. We can't get administrative grants like that year after year after year after yeah. year. So we're asking to increase our budget so that we can hire an intern each summer to do the same amount approximately the same amount of monitoring and we figure if we can cover about 40 properties each year then every three or four years each property throughout the town will be visited and um and recorded excellent because it's important to monitor the town property yeah. like that now conservation commissioners are not paid so yeah. the uh, wages that you see here are for the uh, student or whoever is doing the monitoring of the uh, conservation lands, and for Rayanne, who's the <coughs> conservation coordinator. And the secretary. And the secretary. So that's all included in the 32645 That's correct. Excellent. Okay. And your bottom line is 35525 Correct. Okay. Anybody have any questions for Jay and Rayanne? And they do a terrific job. They really do. Okay, are you ready now? Let's see, you gentlemen made the motion already. Motion, Steve. Okay, are you ready to take the vote on conservation? Yes. 35525 for 2017. Mm -hmm. In favor? David? Yes, Unanimous. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank, Thank you, you for inviting us.